President Donald Trump, who has continually complained that media overplays the COVID-19 pandemic, seemed to suddenly call for more coverage Saturday, saying the media should focus more on the pandemic outside of the United States, even though the U.S. daily rate for new cases is more than four times higher any other nation. 169,595. That's how many new cases the U.S. is adding, on average, every day, according to Johns Hopkins University. That's more than four times the rate of any other country and by far the highest ever reported anywhere in the world. Signs show the coronavirus spike continuing to worsen in the United States. Records for new cases keep coming several times a week, and hospitalizations are also at record levels. Since hospitalizations lag behind cases, it would follow that as long as cases continue to spike, so will hospitalizations. Health officials in many parts of the U.S. are warning that health care systems are on the verge of being overwhelmed. Deaths, which lag behind increases in both, are starting to spike at an increasingly fast pace. More than 1,800 deaths have been reported each of the past three days, a level that hasn't been seen in over six months. Many Western European countries put strict new lockdown measures in place after major COVID spikes. The lockdowns appear to have been effective, as cases are again decreasing. There seems to be no appetite for new U.S. restrictions from Trump's administration, though. The White House praised Florida Governor Ron DeSantis R. and Texas Governor Greg Abbott R. for vowing not to bring any new restrictions, even as cases, hospitalizations and deaths spike in those large states. Trump tweets about election results and skips session on pandemic during G20 CNN, G20 meets on coronavirus as Trump makes 298th golf trip of presidency Forbes Turkey reports record daily number of new COVID-19 patients The Associated Press, nearly 200,000 new U.S. COVID infections Friday. Over 82,000 Americans hospitalized, Forbes England will go on new lockdown after coronavirus spike, Forbes COVID spikes in the biggest states. But Republican governors say no shutdowns this time, Forbes, full coverage and live updates on the coronavirus.